How's it going guys? Welcome back to Talking Walls. Welcome back to a completely different video on the channel today. Seeing as it's international break, I thought I'd do something a little bit different for you all. So, yesterday I went to the Walls Club shop and got the 21-22 season home shirt, obviously made by Castor. But in here, I've got a fake shirt brought from DHgate, which cost me, well, we know the cost, the, the real uh, shirts costing about £55, if we're talking the replica and not the pro version. And this one here from DHgate cost me just under 15 quid. So I'm gonna be comparing the two, seeing the main differences, and seeing if it is really worth paying the £55 to get the official club shirt. I've not even opened this one, I've, I've only just had it today, the, uh, the fake one. So let's open it up and see straight away any real differences. What we're gonna be looking for, obviously, is quality, club badge, what, what, that, what that's like. Uh, the sponsor, the Castor logo. I have got this one printed as well. So we've got a name on the back of this fake one to see what the quality of print is like. And obviously walls have added under Castor lots of different features like the one pack uh, logo there with the club crest and the Castor logo. And at the bottom of the shirt, at the back as well, it says better never stop. So it's going to be interesting to see if those little features are included in this shirt as well. So we are, we've got the shirt. It has come in. Just a standard plastic bag, um, which is pretty decent quality. And straight away, it looks all right. It looks very similar. There is some uh, printing on there, so let's have a quick look. So this right here is the fake one. And well, as you can see, it does have the one pack on the back there. It's still got the plastic on, so I'm going to take that off. The Wolves logo looks very, very dodgy on there, uh, but it does have the one pack there. The Wolves logo isn't as, um, yeah, it's a lot, the, the outline of the logo is a, a much thinner on the fake one, as you can see. Uh, but this is the fake one here. Um, Castor, interestingly enough, the Castor on the fake one is actually embroidered, whereas on the real one, it's only printed. We haven't got, obviously, um, this, the one I got from the wall shop is just the replica, not the pro version. Uh, so on this one, obviously, it hasn't got the pro dots or anything like that on there. The sponsor looks pretty bang on. The logo looks about right. I'm just going to compare the quality and colour. The, the fake one is a shade lighter. The gold is a shade lighter. Um, but we've got the sleeve sponsors on there still. On this one, I've actually got the Premier League badge on there as well. Um, <clears throat> in terms of the front, I don't think I'll put them side by side. I don't think you can really tell an obvious difference at the moment, which is quite interesting. Now we're going to look on the back, uh, the the one I got from the club shop has got this some sort of pattern on the back of it. This one uh, sort of does, but it's not as clear as the, the, the real replica. Uh, you can see here the printing on the back is pretty bang on. I got Raul number nine. Um, the printing is pretty much bang on. Obviously it's been folded up in transit, so you can sort of see the creases in there. But in terms of quality, that's pretty much bang on. But yeah, we'll see on the back here, the back of the shirt does not have that Better Never Stops emblem that is on the uh, legit official club shirt. Uh, but other than that, it's pretty, pretty similar. Um, it's still got, obviously, the official one again has got the wolves above the one pack. It's got wolves across the, the neckline there. This one also has that, but the quality obviously isn't, isn't as good. I'll do a lot of side-by-side -side shots throughout so you can see the difference. Just gonna have a look at the colour, see if there's any differences in the colour. 
of the shirts. I think the official one is just a shade, just a shade lighter, but no obvious differences. Like I've seen before, um, mainly the first year we had Adidas when we got promoted to the Premier League, we had that quite light, almost off yellow colour. And you could tell when people would have the fake shirts on. The, the fake ones are almost a, a lemon yellow. Whereas this one, genuinely, unless you got, you know, looked at the inside of the, the neck, you're not going to tell the difference between these shirts. This one is a shade, a shade different. But you are not going to tell walking down the street. Again, other, other than that embroidered Castor logo, which is strange. That is the biggest difference. You would expect that on the official one, an embroidered merchandiser logo. Um, whereas on the on the official one, on the rep, on the fans version, it's it's printed, which is really really strange. But other than that, it is bang it's bang on. It's not bad at all. You know, for somebody that maybe doesn't quite have the money to buy the the real official shirts, this is not a bad a bad copy at all. Um, in terms of the labels as well, it's got the official Castor label on this on this fake version. Um, on this one, on the walls version, yeah, the, the, I mean, they're very different in, in terms of the information on them, but um, yeah, it, it's not bad at at all. I mean, I'm not, because I've got the official one, I'm not going to be using this one. If somebody wants his shirt, the one with Raoul on the back, leave us a comment in the comment section down below. Uh, but there you go, guys. Fake versus real, not a major difference other than a couple of the things that I've picked out in terms of quality. Yeah, the fake one probably is a little bit thinner in, in, in quality. The Castor stuff I've been really impressed with with, with the quality of it. Um, the fake one is probably that little bit thinner. But uh, yeah, let me know in the comment section down below whoever wants this. Be sure to hit the like button guys. Subscribe to the channel and I'll see you all very, very soon.